So I've arrived in Bridlington on a whim to stop at a pub. First pub we just didn't like the look of, second pub didn't do any food and there was nobody there at all so that I thought it's not very good. So we're down on the beachfront at the minute, Catherine's just out there with Zach walking the dog just to stretch his legs because he's, he's whinging in the back of the van. Um, so yeah I'm just going to look through part of the night, search for sites, places like that and see if we can find somewhere. We wanted to stop at a pub but it looks like we're going to have to end up at the chip shop and then maybe find a lay-by or something. So we've gone a bit further up the coast and we've made it to the shipping at Suabe. There's the pub up there and we've just been in for pizza. <sighs> oh my god, pizzas are amazing. They're a bit big. We got one each. I think we're a bit greedy on that <laughs> one, don't you? Yeah, well you're normally in a pub. They're not, not half as big, but these you just watch the guy through the window making them all in the little log mm. fires. And, oh, it, absolutely booze amazing. Boo's down there. He's got some grass to run around on. Anyway, you can stop here. I'll walk three words it. You have to pay to stop here, even if you buy pub food. It's £15 for a night. So we just thought we'd pay it because... It, some great views here. There's uh, room for five vans in here, they said. So we've got some neighbours there, one across there, and then we've got the view across there. So yeah, absolutely fantastic. This is where we're going to stop tonight. It's lovely and calm as well, isn't it? Yeah. Lovely and calm. Not a breath of wind. It is a bit uneven in here, I must admit. We've got chocks on the one side, but it is where it is. That's it. I'll try and get the drone out in a minute if we can. And get a few drone shots but pizzas are fantastic in there mm. um, I was a bit disappointed with the menu they got but not a lot of choice not a lot of choice but they do have a specials board but there's not much on there either to be fair but what they do have is, is yeah. lovely food we did come up on a whim so yeah anyway Zach wants to get his scooter out so I'll, I better go and get him that out now they're going on scooters I'm going to take dog for a doodle around the field Oh, so there's some steps down to the, oh, give me a minute. <laughs> hey. Raced him to the top and beat him. You got a head start. Oh. Well, that were a bit of a killer to be fair. But there is some steps there to get down to the beach. And obviously the pub and where we parked up there. It's gorgeous along here, isn't it? Just open grassland. It is gorgeous, and if I take you around over there... You can see Bridlington. Where we'll be going tomorrow. Morning. So we come to the bottom of these steps that we investigated last night and look at this little beach down here. Tide's in at a minute but it will be going out in a couple of hours. Yeah. Bit of a steep walk but I thought I'd bring the dog out for a little run along the beach. We can't get on much of the beach at the minute but we will do in a minute. Boo! He's loving it mate. He's loving it. But yeah. Lovely and deserted down here. Obviously you've got Bridlington straight across there. Found an interesting stone down here. Looks like a face.
we've made it into Bridlington, haven't we, mate? Yeah. We're parked in the harbour just there. We only just fit. It's a bit expensive down here, it's a pound an hour. But we tried to get on the front, but the van's just too long, sticks out in the road. So. We'll take Zach for a little look round Bridlington. Some seagulls. We really look right here, look. <laughs> Just wondering if Zach will let me have one of them donuts because they look ever so nice. Maybe. Maybe. Oh. I think the seagulls have gone there. <laughs> he's like, he's like, coming for you, Zachy. He's like, I'll watch a little bit closer. <laughs> <laughs> right, we've got two of them here now, look. You don't want chips. Chips are not good for you. Or donuts. So we just had a nice coffee, haven't we? Oh, one of the nicest coffees. One of the nicest coffees we've ever had. And the guy was lovely. And then we're going to head back to the van now. And I think we're going to go up to Flamborough Head to see the drinking dinosaur. <laughs> aren't we? Yeah. We've never seen Intrigued it before. Intrigued to see it. Never seen it before, so I think we're going to head over there and look at the drinking dinosaur. Uh, I might get the drone up over there as well. But yeah, tide's out at minutes, so there's plenty of beach to go on. But obviously we can't take the dog down there. Which is a shame, it's a beautiful big beach. So we came back to the same spot on the <laughs> harbour that me and Zach had a picture took on this harbour wall behind us here 11 years ago. Well, 11, it's two or 11 three years days. Five days? Mm. No, it's actually, uh, yeah, 11 years and a few days. So I came back to recreate another picture from the picture we took when he was a little baby. <laughs> And now he's still a little baby. <laughs> he's not grown up yet. <laughs> Men never do. It's lovely down here because it's not that busy. And normally, in summertime, you'll get lots of people fishing down here. Uh, we fished down here previously, haven't we? Yeah. And caught a few things. People come crabbing down here. Did think about doing a bit of magnet fishing, but there's no water there at the minute. A lot yeah. of mud. It's a bit breezy, but it's lovely and warm. Yeah, it is a bit. It's a bit breezy. Uh, we think we're going to head up to Flamborough Head in a minute. Yeah. Looks beautiful down there today. Tide's well out at a minute. So we're just heading over to the dinosaur now. Yep. Very busy up here. But the sun's just come out and it's absolutely glorious Yeah, now. it's a lovely day for it, isn't it? Lovely day for it. And we'd, we've never ever been up here before, so it's the first time for us. And if you've not been up here before, you should come up here. So we've made it to the drinking dinosaur, and there it is behind us. Now from this angle, it doesn't look that impressive. Let me show you what it looks like from above.
So we just spotted down there as well, there's a load of seals, so we'll try and get a few pictures of them, won't we? Mm, tons of them. Well, Catherine's not very happy about being up here, because no. it's... Uh, let me show you the drop. Now you wouldn't want to fall down there. So the next mission is find somewhere for a park up. Mm. So I don't know where we're parking yet again. So we're at North's Landing. Um, yeah, it's just just uh, north of Flamborough Head. But there is a sign up saying no overnight parking, but it's a really old sign. It doesn't look like it's in use anymore. We have seen on Facebook that people uh, do stop up here without a problem. But we're not feeling it. And sometimes if you don't feel it, you're better to move on. But uh, it's got a lovely little beach down here. Lots of people playing down there. Some, some beautiful water. And we're only just across from where we were because we were just across there um, at the Drinking Dinosaur. So we're going to head up the coast and we're going to head to Caton Bay because we've stayed up there a few times before and we really like Caton Bay. So we just had a cup of tea and we're going to pack the van away and head up. So we've made it up to Caton Bay, haven't we? Yep. We normally stop a little bit further up the road up there, but you can actually stop down here where we park now. So it's, it's a quiet road and that's the view we get across. So I will put the what three words up for this location, but if you've seen a previous one, the, the other what three words is just, just a little bit further up there. But it's always lovely and peaceful down here, yeah. isn't it? And normally there's other vans up the top there where people normally stop there, there is quite a few vans up there now we might move up there but I think we're just going to stop here yeah. well, Zach's hungry so I need to get his tea cooked and then I'm going to cook Catherine's tea because she's hungry as well that's Zach happy he's got pizza and chicken nuggets so for our dinner we're having uh, steak and chips if anybody's wondering what sort of chips we use we use any frozen chips Whack them in the Ridge Monkey and they cook just fine. So yeah, any frozen chips or uh, french fries and we've got a couple of nice steaks there, one each. So we've got steak and chips for tea and the dog's got a nice bowl of dry biscuits. And you boo? Oh bloody hell, I could do with some steak dad. Well this is what it's all about, the sun's out, there's not a cloud in the sky. It's absolutely glorious tonight. There's Catherine, doing a little bit of washing up. So we're just going to enjoy the night now and then we're going to take you down the beach in the morning. Um, and more importantly we're going to take the dog down the beach because he loves the beach, don't you mate? Oh yeah dad. I love the beach. Rockin' 
Hope you enjoyed coming down the beach with us. It was lovely down there, wasn't it? Mm, really, it? really, really warm. Really, really warm. Um, it's a bit overcast today, but there is a nice little bit of a breeze. It's about 24 degrees. But we slept well down here. It was lovely we and did. quiet. It was peaceful. I mean, the aim was this weekend to spend it all in Bridlington, but it just seems not very friendly for places to park. Really um, difficult to find somewhere to park up. And we know it's nice up here, so obviously we did the pub stop last night, well, night before last, then last night we stayed here. It's peaceful as anything. Yeah, it's one of our favourite little spots up here, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, one of our favourite spots. It's a bit of a killer getting down to that beach, as you've probably just seen, but... Yeah, yeah, that was right. that was a path we'd, we'd not took down to the beach before, but we've yeah, seen everybody going that way. We've never so. gone down that way, and we came back up the normal way over there. Uh, but yeah, but if you, don't forget we've got Instagram, so if you want to follow where we're going to or other little sneak pics and clips, head over there to Instagram. You can find out a bit more. But yeah, I think that's it for this week's video, isn't it? Yeah. And as always, we'll see you in the next one. Bye.